Hey guys, good morning and welcome to the gum series. I'm really excited about this series. Uh, the more series that I'm doing, the more God is blessing me to do it in creative ways that will help praise dance leaders to teach their praise team, again, about praise and worship and who God is as it relates to dance, and as well as develop a personal relationship with God just to deeper that relationship and, you know, take it to a whole nother level. Um, so again, I'm going to start off the gum series, God Use Me, by studying the different names of God in a creative way that praise dance leaders can do that. And I'm going to give you a shortcut. All you have to do is Google the different Hebrew names of God, and that's found within the Old Testament. And within this series, I want to break down and study the different names of God and as well as the meanings. meanings. And as we go further within this process, you'll begin to notice that God has different aspects, okay? So today we're going to focus on the name El, which is spelled E-L. And El means mighty and strong. It discusses God's ultimate strength, might, and power, which is found in Revelations chapter 1 and 8. And you can also go with me to Genesis chapter 17 and 1. So the two verses of today is Revelations chapter 1 verses 8 and then Genesis chapter 17 verses 1. So Revelations reads, I am the Alpha and Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. And go with me to Genesis chapter 17, verses 1. And that reads, Now when Abraham was 99 years old, the Lord appeared to Abraham and said to him, I am God Almighty, walk before me and be blameless. So those are the two verses that you will find um, L, which means mighty and strong. And that's again is in Revelations chapter 1 verses 8 and then Genesis chapter 17 verses 1. Okay guys, thanks so much. Okay guys, so the challenge of the week, I want you to look for four more scriptures that talks about L. Number two, create eight steps that describes God Almighty by using the upper body only and standing in the parallel position. So that means you're going to use your hands, you're going to use your arms, you're going to use the upper torso. So that means bending from side to side or back to forth. But I only want you to experiment with the upper body. Again, that's the hands, that's the arms, that's the head, and moving from side to side, front and back, and that's just using the upper torso only. And the last assignment is to comment or email me and tell me what you think about the lessons and the songs that you can use is here I am to worship how great is our God and I'm going to leave a link within the description box on where you can find these songs on YouTube so I need you to just create eight steps only and I'll go over it again uh, the first challenge of the week you're going to look for four more scriptures that talks about L Number two, you're going to create eight steps that describes God Almighty by using the upper body only. And you're going to stand in a parallel position. So parallel position means you're going to stand with both feet facing parallel and closed. Then you're going to use only the hands, the arms, and the upper torso only. So you can use your sides. You can bend from left to right. You can bend forward and front but I only want you to explore the upper body and the reason why I'm doing that because I want praise dance leaders to get comfortable and familiar with moving their bodies in different ways within the videos as we progress I'm going to show examples on how to do that but for now I just want you to be creative I don't want you to worry about technique or being perfect but just be creative as you listen to the song and just you know just flow and developing your own choreography and the last assignment was to comment or please email me and tell me what you thought about this lesson okay guys have fun i'm excited uh, and even if you want to send me a video of what you've done that'll be great as well so this is a very helpful and fun challenge for the week all right guys have fun take care and i look forward to hearing from you again please subscribe to this channel and leave your comments in the box and be honest and tell me what you think if this is helpful or you need something more and concrete or i need to be a little bit more detailed okay guys thanks so much and be blessed